So the four-year wait is finally over. Day one of the grandest event in world football. And a grand welcome to you as you join us for our live coverage of what we hope will be a game that sets it off in style. Just have a look at it, feel it. This really is the best of the beautiful game. Emotion at fever pitch and the players are ready. Some great scenes here at the Coip, nor would you expect anything else from a ground with its particular reputation. A moment of great pride, the anthems. Well, they have thrown down the gauntlet with that anthem. Now to match it. So a strong start, essential for both teams here as they look to head towards the knockout stage. Well, Peter, I can tell you that both managers will have stressed the need for a very strong start here. Both have also indicated a, a front-foot approach. If that is the case, then I don't think we're going to be complaining at the end. I certainly hope we'll be eulogising. There's an awful lot resting on this, and we'll probably end up reflecting on that. So off we go then. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? I think it's got to be Alexis Sanchez. A sensation when he's in full flow. Uh, although he's played a, as a central striker, I prefer him operating at wide, where he enjoys more space, and that enables him to generate greater momentum for a one-on-one. -on -one. And, and yeah, I think he's a huge threat. Mm, I think the opposition defence agree too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Rincon. Plays a clever pass. Chance to squeeze it through. No, not quite. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Rincon hoists it forward. For a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Well, I'm seeing a very cautious approach to defending. Not a lot in the way of high pressing, which is probably seen as a bit too risky just now. Rincon. Crosses it in. Massive leap! Good delivery, no joy. 
Now that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out. Vidal. I wonder what you've seen, Jim, over the early moments of the game. Well, I think both teams probably feel it's it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. Goes long. Uh, needed a better pass there. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. And it's played forward. That's a promising ball. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Rincon, forward it goes. And no, that is pretty much the... Has a pop! Goal! There is the breakthrough! The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. And it's got through. And he's there to cut it out. It'll be a throw-in. Plays it out to the flank. Lovely bit of skill. Cross it. Header! Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. And he's made sure that that won't get through. And they win it back again. Gorgeous control there. He's got options out wide. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Lovely bit of skill there. There are a few waiting for it. Turns and goes back. Rincon. Looking to get within range. You can get that clear. A really good feat from him. Tries a shot! That's a half-decent try. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Thank 
That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Cleared without complication. Gets it back. Now it's Sanchez. Sanchez plays it forward. That was a good run. The defence looked beaten there. It's gone out for a throw-in. And it's Oriana. Tries to get it forward quickly. Breaks on here. It's a fabulous position, shapes to shoot! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Whistle goes for half time. And there we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. And we're already back on the way here. Chile need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. And helps available out wide. Time to deliver. Now, can he capitalise? Fine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. And out to safety. What a ball, this is to... Going for goal! In it goes! Two to the good! They have breathing space! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. So that's two now without reply. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. That's a throw. Intercepts the throw. That's well read. Hoists it forward. I think they've got to make a statement now to say to their opposition, we're not giving up without a scrap, to give themselves the belief that this is recoverable. Vidal concedes a free kick for that.
crossbar comes to the rescue. And he just whacks it away. And it's played forward. Forward it goes. Done very well to intervene. Plays it out to the wing. Isla battles to win it back. Forward pass. Hoists it forward. Venezuela are probably looking to run the clock down now. They clearly feel that the job is done. It's a very different story for their opponents, though, who just have to throw everything at it and hope for the best. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Drives it towards the front. Alexis Sanchez. Good idea, just poorly executed. Gets it upfield. Gets away from his opponent. It's a great gallop down the right-hand side. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Oriana. Vidal. Aranquiz. Alexis Sanchez. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Rincon. Sanchez is being picked on here. Well, he could end up like a lost sheep, Peter, because they're trying to... And the shot! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Well, it was just some wayward passing that let the opposition in then. And I have to say, a very lucky escape. You lose it there, you expect to be punished. it over to the other flank and that has put paid to that good ball cleared away looking for a corner so now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Rincon. Out to the right. Beautifully done. This game seems as if it's going to go beyond a rescue point, uh, so they need a goal and fast just to raise spirits and at least give their fans something to cheer. He gets past his man. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Well, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. And he's going to have his name taken. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. He's gone direct! Venezuela clearly seem to have lost their passing accuracy, something they're obviously going to have to fix pretty quickly now. It's a loose ball. Eduardo Vargas. Alexis Sanchez. And it's Sanchez. Gets wrestled off the ball. Lobs it in gently. 
Nicely worked. It's a promising run he's making on the right. Deftly done. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. And it's not quite the end of the world, but it doesn't help. A defeat in the first game. Now they need to turn it round and recover over the rest of the group stage. So what do you do?